the Lions had and the free agency tenure of Bob Quinn was the signing of Big V, who you'll see here, number 72 right here, uh, lining up at your right guard position. Now, Big V was especially a big disappointment because he came with a big, fat, hefty contract. Now, Big V was uh, less than effective, I would say, last year. And so far in this game against San Francisco, he's proven his worth. So let's take a look at what we got here. So you're going to see Detroit's going to come out. They're going to join dubs over here. A real tight formation right there with their alignment for the wide receivers. And then they're going to have one receiver here out wide. We got Vata by himself over here. And we got no uh, no down tight end, okay? So that's interesting. Um, but we got the fullback over here lined up like an H-back. Detroit's going to run. Get some motion here just to throw everybody off a little bit. Get the eye candy rolling. And then they're going to run a counter back to the other side. Now, this is a great cut by DeAndre Swift right here. One. Two, I'm going to notice Jason Kabinda does a good job of cut blocking this defender here. And then Khalif Raymond has number three's full attention. So it's going to open up this beautiful run lane for DeAndre Swift to run up through. As you can see, Panay Suel does a good job at getting down to the second level and picking up a blocker. And absolutely, you know what you're going to get out of this guy here and this guy here, Frank Ragnow. Frank Ragnow had his eyes on Fred Warner all day. And anytime he got any chance and run protection to go get him, he wouldn't got him. But you're going to see DeAndre Swift break off a huge run on this play. Now, I didn't mention Vita in this one, but Vita really opens up this lane for Swifty here. So we're going to run this counter. It's going to start off like it's going right behind Vita, and then you're going to cut it back up this way. Vita does a great job of clearing this defender out so that uh, Frank Ragnall has a clear shot to get to the next level. Take out 54. And it just, it's just a work of beauty. Watch. So we're going to send the receiver in motion. Vita is going to get moving. Frank right now is going to give him a little push, but Vita is here. Vita is here with this defender. And that defender in there, see, almost a hold, but he doesn't grab on. You see he's not gripping the jersey. Just does enough to clear him out of the way. And that is all DeAndre Swift needed to get out of there and get up the field. Great job by Havon. Uh, for low topi, <laughs> big V as we'll call him, for the rest of the stream. I'm not. I'm not gonna try to say that name again. But I think Big V did a great job this game of proving that uh, he's worth at least some of the money that we offered him on that contract. Let's look at it again one more time. Again, they're gonna make er think everybody's going this way. You just gotta clear him out so he has room, okay? And that is good leverage right there by Big V. Good leverage, even though it's a misdirection play. And he just does a good job of walling him off so Swifty has that lane to break it back. And then we're going to follow this up on the very next play with some more very good work at a big V here at the right guard spot. I really liked it. We're going to come with a heavy set, two tight ends to the right. We're going to get one of those tight ends screening over in motion. And then we're going to have 77 hauling ass over here. Uh, I think 77 is Ragnow. So we got Ragnow actually swinging across to pick up a left end. Some sweet blocking concepts by the Detroit Lions. We got other linebackers getting up to the next level and putting blocks on Fred Warner. You got this guy here going up to the next level to get linebacker number 57. And it's going to uh, chop block over here. And he's just going to follow Hawkinson right through this hole. Great job by Panay Suel. Great job by Hawkinson. And it just creates a lot more room. If DeAndre Swift cuts this to the outside, Swifty, outside, he probably breaks this thing for a huge run. Instead, he's tackled for a very good run. But if you look at it from another angle here, you're going to see Big V being a big, bad man. I like what I'm seeing out of Big V. We're going to focus on him first. Look at him. Look at the leverage that he gets on this uh, end. Uh, as you can see, this end is screening down to get himself in this play. You know, this play is coming back. He said, I'm not falling for it twice, but Big V is too strong, baby, and seals him up. I love it. That is absolutely great out of Big V, something we didn't get from him last year, something we didn't really see in the – Preseason too much. It's a good job of getting leverage and then maintaining his leverage. The running back tries to bounce back outside. Big V seals him off and creates that lane for DeAndre Swift to get up and get those yards through. Wish Swifty would have kept it outside. Here you can take a look at Jonah Jackson here getting up to the next level, getting a hat on a hat on Fred Warner, making it impossible for him to get involved in the play. We got more good stuff from this offensive line. Big V, I mean, uh, pff, Big Sue, Suell, number 58, Good job. Look at it. Look how strong he is. That guy's wiped out of the play. He never gets any of that. What you reaching for at 92? That's a good block on DJ Jones. And then, of course, 
Uh, you got Frank Ragnow, number 77, gets out here, does a good job of pushing 56 out of the way. Sometimes you don't always have to get that pancake block. You just have to impede. Does a good job of impeding him, taking him out of the play so he can get up in there. Great job by TJ Hawkinson on 51. If there was one spot from the Detroit Lions loss against the 49ers, it was Big V and Panay Suel, Frank Ragnow, these guys on this offensive line, and a kudos to uh, Matt Nelson as well. Hey, did you enjoy this video? Well, if so, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button because I would hate for you to miss any other other film sessions that we got coming on later in the week or any of the other film sessions we got from any of the games we got this year, man.